invited you this afternoon to be here as guests of their wedding. And today we're going to witness the love that they have for God and each other and their desire to commit their lives to one another through the holy vows of marriage. Marriage, first of all, is not man-made, but it is a God-given institution and relationship. So all the sweetness and beauty and joy that you'll find in this partnership is there because God has made it what it is. Therefore, it's going to be imperative for you to make time, place, and have thought for God and your life together. For forever. find Austin that as Lacey gives you her life, her love, and everything she is, and all that she can be to be yours forever, that your responsibility is to be, for her sake, a faithful and loving husband. And Lacey, you'll find that as Austin gives you himself, his name, his honor, his life, so your responsibility is to be a loving and faithful wife. I charge you both to mean everything in the world to each other for your happiness sake. You are my dream. Austin, will you have this woman to be your wedded wife, to live together after God's ordinance in the holy estate of marriage? Will you love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health, forsaking all others? Keep yourself faithful only to her as long as you both shall live? Lacey, will you have this man to be your wedded husband, to live together after God's ordinance in the holy estate of matrimony? Will you love him, comfort him, honor and keep him in sickness and in health, remaining faithful to him as long as you both shall live? When I look in your eyes